Let's put a big smile on your face because today I'm going to show you why they call me the 5 minute man because I build all my sites in less than 5 minutes. So you want to know why they call me the 5 minute man with WordPress and I'm about to show you. So let's click the stopwatch and find out. Alright so we're going to just press the start button. So as you see I have my WordPress site configured the way I want it and I use something called custom codes that I season my WordPress site with how I want how I want the output to be right so let's go to my special custom backup plugin all right and I was gonna click start your backup so right now it's going it's creating an exact copy of our WordPress site with all our configurations our themes our plugins everything you could possibly want the way you want it all right so let's give that a second to go Almost done. Bam, that's done. So let's go to our WP Snapper 2.0 account and let's see what that just did. Here we go. This is now backed up and stored in my WP Snapper account ready to go. So let's check the timer. That was about one minute, okay? So let's pause it, okay? And we're gonna clear it out. And we're going to press, so remember, we're at one minute. We're going to press the start button now, and let's go deploy it. So I'm going to come to dashboard, and I'm going to do a new installation and call this uh, My Fun Toys. Press the save button. Okay, we're going to begin right now. So I'm going to walk myself through my custom wizard, all right? That's going to get me all the configurations I could possibly need. So I press the continue button. I select my cPanel account. I select the local backup we just did. Okay, well, let's make let's make a subdomain right here. Let's call this uh, local2, all right? So that goes and makes sure that everything's good to go. My cPanel account, I press the continue button. Now it's time for me to select which configuration that I want for this site. So I have all my configurations right there in the drop down menu. I click my PR4 tokens and now I have everything. My custom, my custom codes that are already pre-filled with all my information. So my default category is going to be fun toys. Okay. My, um, you can put Google authorization code for webmaster tools if you like. Um, and remember, these are all your configurations for whatever site you want to deploy. All right, so I'm gonna come down here, put my main keyword is oh, fun toys for kids. Okay, that's my main keyword. My site description. Okay, um, best toys for kids review. Now remember, this has my Amazon, my AdSense already configured because I already have it in those token sets, and I'll explain that in a minute. Okay, then we got our site keyword. So maybe it would be uh, beach toys. Um, here we go. Robots and beach balls. Okay, our site title. Okay, the best reviews for fun toys for kids. All right, press save the configurations. Just one moment. All right, so here's the summary. We're basically going to look at what we just did, and I'm going to press install site. All right, so now it's installing. Okay, creating the DB user. It's creating my domain name. Upload completed. Now it configures your settings. So remember, everything that you have in those custom codes is already is being configured in the site, and we're just finishing up. Boom, we are done. Press the success button so you can see what you did. All right, so let's look at what the stop. Three minutes. Three minutes and eleven seconds. So with the backup, that is less than five minutes. So I am the four minute man, all right? So we're gonna visit the site and let's see what that did. Okay, so now as you see, we have the best reviews for fun toys for kids. We have our site description, everything is filled out. Now remember the site before, it just had our custom codes. Nothing, nothing all fancy. But when we're done, we have it all ready. Our AdSense, our Amazon with the toys, our widgets, and everything ready to go. So now all you need to do is make your post and make money. So I got that done in four minutes. Now, 
The one that save you time, okay, and money, and frustration, and headaches, they get these sites out really, really, really fast. I think so. And that's the power of Snapper 2.0. So let's dig in a little deeper. I'm at my dashboard, and how do I get this all set up? Well, first of all, you can have as many cPanel accounts as you like. Just put your username and passcode, and you're done. Amazon S3, no problem. You can have as many Amazon S3 storage accounts as you like. Okay, you can just press the new button and you'll be set to go. We also have Google Dropbox, okay? I mean, Google uh, Drive and, and uh, Dropbox. So all you need to do is, is link your account to Dropbox and link your account to Google Drive. And now you can back up right to Google Drive. Now you can back up right to uh, Dropbox and then deploy it with WP Snapper 2.0. Uploading to Snapper is a breeze. All you need to do is click here, go to your uploads, and choose if you want to do a new upload to Amazon S3 or an upload to Google Drive or Dropbox. So let's do click Dropbox Uploader. We'll put a short title, my new Dropbox um, backup. Okay, we select our Dropbox account, which is already linked with one click of ease, and let's pick our backup file. So we're gonna go look for the backup really fast. Okay, and then we press start upload. So now this is going to upload, okay, right to Dropbox. And then now you'll, with WP Snapper 2.0, you can deploy it right from your Dropbox account. So how sweet is that? It'll actually put it on your computer for you, and then you can automatically, all right, install it with WP Snapper. Very, very easy. <laughs> Here we go. So my new Dropbox backup is right over here. Okay, I uploaded my file. Now I can deploy right from Dropbox. And you can do the same with Amazon S3 and Google Drive. It's really that simple. But it doesn't stop there because we're gonna set up our sites with custom tokens. Now what do we mean by tokens? Tokens are custom codes. I'm not talking about the subway code tokens that you put into the, the slot as you're trying to get on a transit. Okay, what this token means is that you can pre configure as many different sites as you like. So, say you have an Amazon site, a ClickBank site, all right, maybe you have a lead page template with your themes and plugins, maybe you have offline lead pages. Well, it's as simple as clicking manage your tokens. When you click manage your tokens, you can add as many as you like. You just click add and you can add as many and remove them as you like. So what it'll do is it'll start for you. So when you back up, you back up your site with our custom backup plugin, you'll be able to manage them right here. You see the plugin also works with uh, Dropbox, Google Drive, an FTP account, and Amazon S3. All you need to do is click authorize, and all you need to do is save your Google Drive account, and then you can back up right to these storage properties, your websites seamlessly, that integrate right into your WP Snapper account. Because you go under your uploads, and now you'll see them listed for here, for you to either download, or you to use our five minute wizard to install. Yes, you are looking at version 2.0. Even easier to make these sites. Even easier for customization and total control. The setup is very customized. You can make the sites however you want them. Everyone that works with WordPress needs a backup solution. But wouldn't it be easier if you can customize it on the fly? Well, we're giving you a 30-day trial period. That's a 100% money-back guarantee. If you can't succeed with WP Snapper 2.0, please ask for your money back. We know you will love it. So look at what this does. Most backup solutions out there sell for $97 to $197, and that could even be monthly. And they don't even do 95% of what WP Snapper 2.0 does. We have built in so much more functionality than 1.0, and our backup plugin has been reinvented. You can schedule them, set and forget, everything will be seamlessly sent to your Snapper account so you can deploy whenever you wish. Now remember, this is only for seven days at a 70% discount. Once the offer is gone, you will not be able to get this price point ever again. So isn't it time that you saved yourself the headache and the money 
trying to create these sites, let us do all the hard work for you. Remember, this is only for seven days and then the offer will be closed. Thanks for watching this video.